you believe a bomber built in the 1950s might still be flying missions in the 2050s and beyond? That's not science fiction, it's the plan. The United States Air Force is taking the legendary B-52 Stratofortress and giving it a massive upgrade. These new B-52s, enhanced with modern engines, radar, and avionics, are expected to fly well into the 2050s or even longer. Yes, the same bomber that dropped bombs in Vietnam is now being prepared to outlast pilots who haven't even been born yet. Why keep such an old aircraft around? Why not build something new? Because no other bomber in US history has proven more reliable, versatile, and downright durable than the B-52. And now with the latest upgrades, it might become the first warplane in history to serve for a full century. This is not just a story about an aircraft. It's about engineering brilliance, strategic planning, and how the B-52 is being reborn for the age of hypersonics and cyber warfare. The B-52 Stratofortress was first introduced in 1955 during the Cold War, designed as a long-range strategic bomber capable of delivering nuclear payloads deep into enemy territory. Built by Boeing, the aircraft quickly became a backbone of American air power. Over the decades, it has served in multiple wars, including Vietnam, the Gulf War, Iraq, and Afghanistan. Its iconic silhouette and eight-engine roar are instantly recognizable, earning it the nickname Buff, Big Ugly Fat Fellow. Now, after more than 60 years of service, the B-52 is getting a second life. The U.S. Air Force has begun testing upgraded versions of the aircraft under a program called B-52 Commercial Engine Replacement Program, CERP. The plan is to keep the aircraft flying until at least 2050, potentially making it the first aircraft to serve 100 years in continuous military operation. With its upgrades, the B-52 will become a 21st century strategic bomber, able to carry advanced weapons, communicate through modern networks, and fly with better fuel efficiency. This massive upgrade project isn't just about nostalgia or budget savings, it's about military strategy. The B-52 is one of the few platforms capable of carrying nuclear weapons and long-range cruise missiles, including future hypersonic weapons. With global tensions rising and peer competition from China and Russia heating up, the U.S. needs a flexible, global-reaching bomber. And the B-52, with its new heart and brain, fits the role perfectly. The Engine Replacement Program, SERP. One of the biggest changes to the B-52 is the replacement of its engines. The original Pratt and Whitney TF-33 engines, which date back to the 1960s, are becoming obsolete. These old engines are inefficient, expensive to maintain, and increasingly unreliable. That's why the Air Force has selected Rolls-Royce F-130 engines to power the future fleet. These new engines are based on proven commercial designs used in Gulfstream and Bombardier jets. The F-130S are smaller, lighter, and far more efficient than the TF-33s. According to Rolls-Royce, they will provide better fuel economy, increased range, and 30% lower maintenance costs. Even more importantly, these engines will require far fewer overhauls, meaning the B-52 can stay in the air longer and more often. The new engines will be paired with updated engine nacelles and pylons designed by Boeing, ensuring a perfect integration into the B-52 airframe. Testing of the F-130 engines is already underway at NASA's Stennis Space Center and Rolls-Royce's facilities. Full flight testing is expected to begin by 2026, with the first fully upgraded B-52s entering service by 2030. The goal is to re-engine all 76 active B-52s, which would allow the aircraft to remain in frontline service until at least 2050 and possibly beyond. Avionics and cockpit upgrades. While the engines are the most visible change, the inside of the B-52 is also getting a major upgrade. Much of the aircraft's avionics system navigation, communication, radar, and targeting systems still uses analog or outdated digital technology. The new upgrades will bring the B-52 cockpit into the modern age with digital displays, advanced radar systems, and state-of-the-art navigation tools. Boeing and the U.S. Air Force are installing a new active electronically scanned array radar, derived from the radar used in the F-A-18 Super Hornet. This radar dramatically improves the aircraft's ability to detect and track targets at long distances, operate in contested environments, 
and even perform limited ground mapping. It makes the B-52 more effective in both nuclear and conventional missions. Pilots will also benefit from new digital flight displays, upgraded mission computers, and improved data links for better coordination with other aircraft and ground assets. These changes not only make the B-52 more lethal and capable, but they also reduce pilot workload and increase situational awareness, which is critical in high-threat environments. Weapons and payload capabilities. The B-52 has always been known for its enormous payload capacity. It can carry up to 70,000 pounds of bombs, missiles, and other ordnance. With the upcoming upgrades, its weapons capabilities are expanding even further. The bomber will be fully compatible with modern smart weapons, long-range cruise missiles, and even hypersonic weapons currently under development. One of the key features of the modernized B-52 will be its ability to carry the AGM-183, a air-launched rapid response weapon ARRW, a hypersonic missile capable of traveling at over Mach 5. Hypersonic weapons are seen as a game changer in future conflicts because they are extremely fast, maneuverable, and difficult to intercept. The B-52 will also carry new versions of the long-range standoff LRSO missile, replacing the aging AGM-86B cruise missile. In addition, the aircraft's internal weapons bay will be modified to carry more advanced munitions, freeing up wing hardpoints for additional weapons or fuel tanks. These changes will allow the B-52 to serve in a variety of missions, from precision strike to electronic warfare, making it one of the most versatile platforms in the Air Force arsenal. Cost effectiveness and reliability. Why invest billions into upgrading an old bomber instead of building a new one from scratch? The answer lies in cost and reliability. The B-52 has already proven itself over six decades of service. Its airframe is incredibly strong, with many parts showing little sign of fatigue. Building a new bomber of similar range and capability would take years and cost significantly more than upgrading the B-52. According to Air Force officials, the cost of upgrading the entire B-52 fleet is expected to be less than developing and producing an all-new strategic bomber. And since the B-52 already has established training, maintenance, and logistic systems, the transition will be smooth and efficient. That makes the B-52 not just a smart military decision, but also a smart financial one. In terms of reliability, no bomber in U.S. history comes close to the B-52. With proper maintenance and upgrades, many of the current airframes could fly well past 100 years of service. That's an extraordinary achievement in aviation history, and it's a testament to the original design's strength and flexibility. Strategic importance in modern warfare. The world is changing fast. New threats are emerging from nations like China, Russia, and Iran. Cyber warfare, anti-access, dust area denial, A2-AD zones, and long-range missile threats are reshaping how wars are planned and fought. In this environment, having a bomber that can fly thousands of miles, launch precision weapons, and stay connected with the battlefield is more important than ever. The B-52, with its new engines, radar, and weapons, fills that role perfectly. It can operate from U.S. bases and reach targets across the globe without needing refueling. It can also act as a command and control node, relaying information between aircraft, satellites, and ground forces. Its large payload capacity means it can deliver a massive blow in a single mission, something few aircraft can match. Furthermore, the psychological impact of the B-52 cannot be underestimated. When enemy forces see a formation of these massive bombers in the sky, they know something serious is coming. It's a symbol of American military power, and its presence alone can alter the course of a conflict. The B-52 isn't just an old warbird, it's a living legend. From Cold War missions to 21st century upgrades, it's now being reborn to serve for 100 years. With modern tech, new engines, and advanced weapons, it's ready to fly alongside stealth jets and drones for decades to come. This isn't the end of the B-52 story, it's a bold new chapter. So the next time you see it in the sky, remember, it's not just flying, it's dominating. Like this video if you're amazed by the B-52's journey, and don't forget to subscribe for more powerful stories from the skies.